you've brought some of that pretty good European form back home. Yeah, it's, it's just nice to be home. It's been two years since I've actually been back, so I'm just so happy, to be quite honest, and to obviously be playing is a bonus, but um, yeah, no, overall pretty good. You sort of snuck under the radar a little bit yesterday because uh -huh. there were some good scores early and you went about your business and a bit this morning as well. Yeah. That feel pretty good to post the score and let them deal with the afternoon? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I, I stay patient all day yesterday and obviously this morning it was blowing a gale, but uh, it's the same for everyone. So yeah, I just placed it. In, in all the right positions really. Um, only one got me on one of the sucker pins, but uh, on 15, but uh, 16, sorry. Um, but yeah, other than that, I played really, really well. So, pretty solid. And it's, it is different golf than what you play in Europe. You're mm -hmm. obviously used to playing golf in Australia, but it, like I said, it's a long time. Has it been an adjustment period coming home and playing firmer sort of stuff and everything like that? Right? Uh, it's nice to play in the heat. <laughs> like I'm so used to uh, wearing jumpers and trousers but uh, no it's just nice to be in the sun to be quite honest with you but uh, no playing in the wind in Europe is uh, it's quite normal so coming out here is just like <laughs> just watching your results in Europe this year you had one of your better years um, mm -hmm. do you feel like you are improving and I'm wondering why why that might be yeah definitely more mentally than anything it's just nice to be able to play smoothly and you know stay you've got to stay calm and obviously stay in the moment more than anything so that's that's what I've improved on quite a lot and putting as well so it's actually nice to see it going in the hole so yeah it's all coming along together quite nicely what did you think might have been a good score in those conditions this morning oh yeah five under is pretty solid <laughs> I was very very pleased with that and an eagle on two as well that was an extra little bonus but um yeah no pretty pretty solid very very happy how yesterday. long was that eagle on two how long a putt that was about nine foot mm. so yeah, I hit driver three wood in. <laughs> so, I'm gonna make it work, right? It <laughs> doesn't matter how far away it is, you find a way. The course is, you're all familiar with the course, but it is playing a little bit different. They've pushed a few tees up, a few mm -hmm. tees back. Has it been a little bit of an adjustment as well, just with driving lines and stuff? Yeah, it's amazing because the, the LPGA a couple of years ago, it, it was playing so long. Yeah. And especially with the wind, it's even harder. So I had that mentality of, you know, oh, it's a little bit shorter, so t take the, advantage of what we've got and like we've got so many more wedges in and things like that so yeah i guess i, I did take advantage obviously two rounds to go mm -hmm. um, but if you do get in the mix or if you're in the last group tomorrow maybe mm -hmm. with hannah or something like that how do you think you'll handle that yeah good i love it uh, i mean it's it's what i'm here for i'm here here to win so uh, i can't wait for the weekend whatever happens happens right but i'm just gonna have some fun yeah. nice. thank you whitney